Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Anupriya Goyal from Berkowitz Hair and Skin Clinic and today I'll be talking about two main causes of hair loss and the solution for the same. If you want to know in detail about all the causes of hair loss, how to diagnose them and what are the nutritional supplements to take for them, then do watch my other videos on hair loss. Their links are mentioned in the description box below. The most common cause of hair loss is androgenetic alopecia that is genetic pattern of hair loss. It affects 80% of men and 50% of women in their lifetime. In men, it presents with bitemporal recession of the hairline and thinning of hair at the vertex. In women, it presents with diffuse thinning of hair in the crown region with maintenance of the frontal hairline. Now, androgenetic alopecia presents with progressive miniaturization of the hair, that is decrease in diameter, length and pigmentation. The second most common cause is telogen effluvium. It presents with diffuse hair loss all over the scalp and it is usually due to decrease in hemoglobin levels, increase in stress levels, altered thyroid levels and nutritional deficiencies. To assess the severity of hair loss, we have various classification systems. In men, Hamilton Norwood grading system classifies the hair loss in seven grades. Grade 1 to 4 can be treated medically and by in-house clinic treatments. However, grade 5 to 7 have to be treated by a hair transplant. Similarly, in women, it is the Ludwig's classification system which classifies hair loss in three grades. Grade 1 to 2 can be treated medically or at the clinic. However, grade 3 must undergo a hair transplant. To assess the severity of hair loss, other than taking history, we perform various blood tests, hair pull test and dermatoscope or proscope analysis to assess the severity of thinning of hair. Person who is suffering from hair loss must make application of the medical solution or minoxidil on their scalp a part of their lives. They have to apply the solution every single day of their lives. Other than this, intake of oral medicines like anti-androgens and concoction of multivitamins also help in hair growth. If the hair loss is due to a nutritional deficiency or altered hormonal levels, then the treatment is focused on the same. There are various in-house clinic treatments available for hair loss and according to the grade of hair loss and the patient's requirement, we formulate a plan. They include dermaroller treatment, second, low-level laser therapy, PRP or platelet-rich plasma, if you want to know in detail about creative rich plasma, you can see my other video which has detailed explanation about PRP and the link is mentioned below. A combination of dermaroller, laser therapy and PRP is extremely effective. However, weekly to monthly sessions of treatments are required. Now some people want a one-time solution. For them, Regenera Activa, a US FDA approved stem cell treatment is the treatment of choice. In this we take a small piece of tissue from the back of your scalp, extract stem cells from the same and put this solution on your scalp which leads to similar results as compared to what the treatments I just mentioned like the laser therapy, derma roller and the PRP. The results stay for one and a half to two years and they have to be maintained by application of minoxidil and oral medications. For higher grades of hair loss in both men and women, hair transplant is a revolutionary treatment because it brings natural results in just one session and they remain for many many years depending upon the environmental conditions and how you maintain them. Cosmetic camouflage hair products and hair replacement patches are also very popular options. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this video useful. Leave your comments below if you have any queries. Subscribe to our channel. And you can follow us on Instagram on the links below. Thank you.